Welcome to the channel Cool Catcher. Today we will discuss about the topic food analysis, mainly about the chromatography. Question number one. In gas chromatography, the area under a graph shows up. So the answer is the area under a graph shows in gas chromatography that is concentration of substance present in the sample question number second dash is the ratio of concentration of solute in stationary phase to concentration of solute in mobile phase that is partition coefficient third question supercritical fluid chromatography refers to the chromatography performed at a pressure and temperature so the answer is about the critical value of mobile phase. Question number 4. In partition chromatography, so in partition chromatography, both mobile and stationary phase is liquid. Question number 5. Page is, page is a polyacrylamide gel electrophoresis. So, we can tell that Page is a type of chromatographic technique. Question number 6. Paper chromatography. So, paper chromatography is a partition chromatography. Question number 7. In ion exchange chromatography, cation exchange contain. So, cation exchange contain negative charge. Question number 8. To be useful ion exchanger, a material must be. So, to be useful ion exchange, exchanger, a material must be both ionic in nature and highly permeable. Question number 9. In ion exchange chromatography, the interaction between solute and stationary are primarily. So, Interaction between solute and stationary are primarily electrostatic. Question number 10. Which of the following separation method does not depend upon the charges and the size of the separating material? So, affinity chromatography does not depend upon the charges and the size of the separating material. The full form of GC and NC. GC is gas chromatography. MC is mass spectrometry. Question number 12. Which chromatography is based on the specific reversible interaction between soluble molecule and a legend immobilized on the chromatographic stationary phase? So that is affinity.